Hey everybody, in this doll review I have the Monster High Monster Family of Laguna Blue with Laguna and her little sister to pack to unbox and review. Here's a look at the back where you get the artwork of Laguna and Ebby and Kelpie who is in this pack and some artwork of Kelpie and Ebby together. And it also shows the other packs available. Here's a look at the accessories that come with them. We have this green basket. There's a little room in it. Um, the plastic is pretty stiff. It, it's a little bit flexible. You can get things in there. And then we have this little pink basket that has a drink in it. It's blue drink with a shark head. And then also this other canister. Could be maybe sun spray or a sandwich, I believe. Maybe a sandwich. Here's a look at Kelpie first. She comes with these really interesting sunglasses. And then in her hair, she has a purple hairband that looks like a piece of kelp. She has these really big ears that look like fins and purple lips and I love her hair it's a light blonde and blue color but it's very very curly it looks a bit messy but I like all the really tiny curls going down into her outfit which is a swimsuit with a cute cover-up skirt that's a bit see-through it's a two has two shoulders. The one is just a little black thread uh, ribbon, and then the other one you can see more pronounced has that scaly heart on it with the spikes. And then the skirt, which is a separate piece, is just the thin mesh. Kelpie doesn't have any elbow or knee joints or wrist joints, just the shoulder and hip joints. So you can see the molded scales are more prominent on her than I would say for Laguna and then finally she's wearing these simple sandals that are made out of kelp and then an interesting look on her feet is that she has clawed toes still check out Laguna on her head is her sunglasses which are this bright orange color and then her hair is styled very straight with just this one big curl at the bottom and there's very little of that greenish sea foam color in the front it's mostly just her golden blonde hair some streaks in the back too she has purple eyeshadow and then when I was checking out her pose and her body, her body is actually, I think, a different mold. It's twisted into this very swimsuit, swimsuit pose with the, the leg, but the body seems different, too. Like, it's bent more to the side. Going down into her swimsuit, she has this bright swimsuit with the orange V, and then the little shorts that go along with it and then down are her shoes which are these simple shoes that have like bubbles on them they're that bright orange again sea foam bubbles okay so my review and rating for this two pack of the monster family Laguna with Kelpie and Laguna um, some overall thoughts uh, I think that Laguna is my the doll in the set that I think is of a less quality. I think Kelpie is really cute. I do wish she had joints, obviously, um, in her elbows and knees. But I think her design and her fashion is really cute. And the clothes uh, are high quality. And um, her hair's a little messy, but I really like it. I like the curls, those wild curls. Um, 
And just overall, I am a fan of her doll. The Laguna is very stiff, and her pose is a very supermodel pose, um, like a swimsuit supermodel pose. And her swimsuit and the colors with this bright orange clash a lot with her little sisters, which Laguna's normal color scheme is like a turquoise sea foam and like salmon colors, which if they had just stuck with her usual colors, would have gone pretty well with Kelpie, but with this bright orange and kind of hunter green color they got with the skirt, it clashes a lot and that's not visually appealing to me. Um, I don't like her swimsuit that much on its own without Kelpie. I think the design is just all right. The colors are kind of muddled together in a distance. The only thing that really stands out to me is the bright orange. Um, kind of looks like a cr crossing guard to me. <laughs> um, so overall, uh, I think it's a cute pack. I think Kelpie is definitely the draw in this pack. Um, the Laguna is just a almost a throwaway doll to me. Um, so for the Kelpie, I would give her an 8 out of 10. And for Laguna, I'd probably give her like a 3 out of 10. Thanks for watching the review. Bye!